Hey my loves, welcome back to my channel. So if you guys remember not too long ago, I did my first ever Coach unboxing. Well, Coach has recently released a new collection but this time instead of it being strawberries it was cherries and you know i had to pick out a few because they were just too cute to let slide and so today we're gonna do another kind of like an unboxing but i already unboxed them so we're gonna pretend that i unboxed and i'm gonna show you guys what i got to start off with i went with this pretty pretty heart bag here's a close-up it has the brown coach canvas and it has these beautiful little cherry prints and the cherries are like little hearts they are just too cute the front has the gold hardware the back is the exact same print but of course no gold hardware it has this little top handle and it did come with their classic little leather tag and a little cherry keychain how freaking cute is that i wish that my strawberry bags would have come with a little strawberry charm that is just adorable it does have two pockets so it has one in the front and one in the back and it does still have the packaging in here i'm gonna take it out So it has this one little pocket. It does have the tags on here and it says the comparable value is 378 US dollars. I purchased it um, like the day that it dropped. I actually think I purchased it a day early because I had like the insiders exclusive. I think I paid $199 for it. That's how much it came out to after the discounts. So this pocket is very, very small. It doesn't even appear to be like at half of this. It appears to end right here. So not much room, but let's look at the back pocket. Maybe there's more room there. So here is the back side pocket and it is about the same size they are both very very small there's not much room in here at all i honestly thought that it was gonna be a little bit bigger like when i got this in the mail i was shocked to see how small this bag actually was it did come with this shoulder strap very pretty it has like the chain the gold chain at the end of them i am not a shoulder strap type of girl so i'm just gonna put that back in here back to the sizing i was very much disappointed in the size like it's cute but it's very very small i was thinking it would be more so the size of my kate spade heart bag which is this bag right here love this bag 10 out of 10 but as you guys can see like this is a lot smaller than this and for the price for 200 dollars, i feel like this should have been a little bit bigger like this is just so little of a bag for the price that i don't know i just think that had it been this much bigger like had it been this size it would have been perfect but there's not much i can put in here it is so small that my phone wouldn't even fit in here like i could fit my galaxy flip in here like if it was open i couldn't but because it folds i'm able to put that in here but still like I don't like the fact that I'm carrying around a purse and I still have to put my phone in my back pocket. So am I going to keep the bag? Yes. I'm going to keep the bag because it is very cute and I'm a sucker for cherries. But that's like my one complaint. I just wish it was a little bit bigger. Had this been a little bit bigger, it would have been perfect. In addition to that little heart bag, I also purchased their cherry tote bag. So... I purchased this in the same exact canvas print. It has the brown coach canvas with the little red heart cherries. And this one is called 
their Cherry Signature City Tote. I really wanted a new work bag and I love getting like a matching work bag with a personal bag. I love having like the set, which is what I purchased this for. And this is very, very roomy. I'm gonna take out the packaging. Oh, ew, I don't like that at all. Ew. Wait, I think it's a sticker. Oh, it is. <gasps> you guys, I thought this was just blue. And I was like, why would they put a blue tag, like a blue anything on a purse with this color scheme? But it's just, it's like a protective film. This is the tote bag. Very pretty. It is a little bit flimsy, to be honest. Like, I don't know. I think my first impression of Coach was so much better than what this was i'm a little bit disappointed i'm not gonna lie because just look at how flimsy this bag is i don't know i feel like it should have a little bit more you know like structure to it this bag shows comparable value 428 and i think i got this one for 180 if I'm not mistaken. The sizing is very good. My laptop will fit in here comfortably along with my notebooks and my planners. Everything should fit. So the sizing is okay. I just don't know if the quality is up to par on this. Like, I don't want this to be peeling after a couple months, you know? This one also came with the little baby pink coach tag this one didn't come with little cherries though i wish it did because that would be the cutest and on the inside it is a tan camel color i do love that it always has this little coach emblem on the inside here is this along with like the serial number and it does have a little side pocket where it has the coach stuff and there's something else in here i don't know what this is that may be a security tag. I don't know. You guys, let's do a quick comparison. This is my strawberry bucket. This is my city tote. And look at just how flimsy this is in comparison to my strawberry bucket bag. Like, this material is, like, reinforced almost. It holds its shape. You can't just, like, crunch it. Like, I, you know, I can't just, like bend it how I can bend this and this was cheaper than this I think I purchased this for like 150 or 160 and the quality for this is amazing I've used this quite a few times and it still looks brand new so I honestly am just so disappointed in this collab this feels like something I could have got off of Sheen to be honest with you definitely don't feel like it's worth 170 I wouldn't even think this was worth like 120 to be very honest with you guys and I know that it can't necessarily be the fact that it's a tote because I have a tote from Michael Kors that I used as a diaper bag when my little girl was a baby and that tote was amazing I mean that thing could stand up on its own you you know what, what I'm saying like you weren't bending that and I still have that tote to this day and the quality is just not there. The quality is just not there for me in this collab. It's just so thin. And honestly, I would, I don't know. I almost don't know if the cuteness of this cherry line makes up for the downhill in quality for me. I'm not sure. I'm going to have to make that decision after I use it a couple times and see because you guys like I'm going to put heavy stuff in here and it's going to like come out of the bottom or something like it's going to be looking like that. Ew. And I don't know. I just hope it doesn't start peeling and it doesn't start, you know, coming apart at the seams because I will be more than disappointed. Here are both of the bags in comparison. Let me know what you guys think. Honestly, I'm a little disappointed with both, so I don't even want to choose right now because I'm kind of giving them both a cold shoulder. I don't know. Hopefully, the next time that they release a cute little line, it comes with the coach quality behind it, okay? Anyways, I hope you guys like this video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, hit the little bell for the notifications, and also click the little link in my description so you guys can follow me on all of my socials, and I will see you guys soon.